Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I just wanted to do a quick review of the Amscope Student Microscope. We just got this a couple of days ago, and so far we're really liking it. Um, the girls have had a chance each to take a peek at some of the slides and uh, had a little bit of fun. So I wanted to just show you what comes with the microscope and what I bought that was extra. So the first thing that I want to say is that this video is not endorsed by Amscope. These are all my own opinions and, and what I think of the microscope, how I feel about the microscope and what comes with it. So this is all just me. Um, so again, not endorsed by the microscope company at all. But it's really a clean, like a real clean design. I really like the way that it looks and let me see if I can give you a good, a good view of it. It's, it looks really sleek and one of the things that I think I love the most about it is the handle right here. I really like that it comes with, that it's designed with a handle in it because oftentimes schooling doesn't happen in a, you know, a setting where they're sitting at their desks or um, sitting at the table. It allows for us to go outside with a microscope and me feeling comfortable bringing the microscope with us maybe out to the patio and letting them um, you know, maybe my oldest or even my youngest, as long as she's really careful, um, move it and me being comfortable with that. So I really like the handle. I think that's a great um, part of the microscope. So it comes with, you know, of course the, the stage right here moves up and down. Let's see if I can, I can show you the, it's really hard to do this when I'm not. Um, but it moves, it moves up and down. It's got the um, the prongs so that you can hold the slide. Right now it's actually got frog blood on there. They got a kick out of seeing some of the slides yesterday that came with the microscope and I'll show those. Um, but it, another thing that I really like about it is that it also comes with the adapter. It's all kind of messy because we were using it yesterday, but it comes with the adapter and it plugs in right here. And it also comes with the batteries so that you can you can take it without having to plug it in which I like and again that brings me back to um, using it out on the patio so I like I like that a lot uh, another thing that I like about the microscope is that it is lit from the bottom and let's see if you can if you can see oh no it's not plugged in hello hang on let me plug it in okay so let me just go ahead and turn it on um, like I was saying one of the things that I like about that is that um, it is lit from both the bottom, so you would turn it on here and turn it on in the back here and it lights up from the bottom and it dims with this knob and then if you, and that's so that if you're looking for, for things that get best light, like plants and things like that, that get the best view when it's lit from underneath, you would use something like this and then it is also lit from the top. So then you would switch it from the bottom to the top and you would turn it up again, and it's lit, and I'll see if I can show it to you. It's lit right here from the top, so that you can look at things that might be a little bit bigger, um, like a bug that you can't flatten and put onto the stage on a slide. So let me just show you quick, um, let me just show you quick some of the things that it comes with. Like I said, there was already on there a slide that came with the kit, see if you can you can see this put it up against the but this is a slide of frog blood which my girls um, had a fun time with but also my youngest didn't like it very much because <laughs> the idea of it coming from a frog and that a frog was hurt was not very fun for her to think about but that was just part of um, the slide set that came with it but I'll, let me just show you real quick what comes with the microscope and I'll just kind of move this aside so that you can still see it one of the things I keep saying that one of the things it comes with this Usborn Science um, and Experiments book, The World of Microscopes, this is really a great book. And I'm going to back it up just a little bit to see if I can show you some of the pages. But it, it, it's a great book. It really goes in-depth about the things that you need to know about a microscope. It goes in-depth about the parts of a microscope. Because I think the only thing that I found so far with getting this microscope is that it doesn't come with instructions on how to use this specific microscope. It it comes with this book, but this book isn't for this microscope. So all microscopes function a little bit. They function the same, but some of the um, some of the parts might function a little bit differently. You know, I, I 
I know microscopes that have this part, the stage, but the, the stage actually moves around so that you don't have to move your slide to get it in the right position to see the best. So all, you know, microscopes can be a little bit different. And the microscope didn't come with instructions with this, with information about every part of this microscope. And I think that's a real bummer. But it did come with this book from Usborne, and it does. It shows a lot of detail. It shows um, some of the things that you can do with the microscope. And it also shows you some of the fun projects that you can do um, with this, like uh, looking at feathers, hair, looking at photographs, um, looking at dust. I'm not sure I'd want to see that. Uh, looking at a piece of onion to see the cells of an onion to peel the membrane back and, and take a look because of course most kids get to do that in school when they're in a public school I remember doing that in science and I got the biggest kick out of it so I think my kids would as well so it does give you ideas about projects and it gives you ideas about the things that you want to take a look at um, microscopic life in the sea and it, and it gives a little bit of history as well about the history of a microscope so you can buy the book separately if you buy a microscope that this is not included, but you, so you can get it separate. A little strip, and I'm, gonna, and I'm not really sure that you guys will be able to see this, but it comes with a little strip of stickers. I have a container of blank slides, but I also have a container of slides that are already prepared. Um, and. I can't remember if these ones came with the microscope um, or these ones came with the microscope. I do have two different sets here. I'm pretty sure these are the ones that came with the microscope. As you can see, one of the slides is pollen, but you can see um, different ones. Different. There's pollen. They got the biggest kick out of looking at the horsefly leg. <laughs> it's gross and interesting all at the same time and really hairy. So, and it comes in like a, a really well protected container. The nice thing. Um, I had seen when I ordered, you know, when I had ordered it, that people were complaining that it was not packaged in a way that kept it safe during shipping. And this came in a really well packaged styrofoam container, and everything was packaged really well. It was all maintained really well inside the box. Nothing was broken, everything works. And so it was really nice. I had no complaints about the, the way it was packaged and, and sent. Um, it comes with another lens. It also comes with a microtome, which I had to look up to find out what this does. But I guess what this is for is the things that you're looking on in the slide, like plant parts, they need to be really thin in order to see them. And this helps you um, slice those pieces into very thin layers so that you can look at them through the microscope. So that's what this does. It comes with two, whoops, um, one is the, the eosin stain, and this is the, um, the methylene blue stain. Oops, bring it up here. So it comes with the stains, but they are in powder form. I keep dropping them. They are in powder form. So I'll have to find out how much liquid to add to those in order to get them so that we can use them. Again, it comes with batteries so that you can unplug it and take it outside with you. It comes with Kim wipes so that you can, you can clean your, um, this is really, really thin paper and it's special for uh, microscopes, cleaning your microscope and cleaning the slides and the cover slides. Um, and you'll see, it's just super, super, super thin. You can see, you can see right through it. And so you'll use those to, to clean the white, uh, clean the slides. This, let's see, it comes with a thing of tweezers. It comes with a Petri dish and inside comes with a Petri dish. And inside the Petri dish are cover slides for the, um, for the slides that you prepare yourself. And then it also comes with, um, let me take the little cover, oh, I'm, <laughs> I'm using the, um, I'm not really even sure what this is called, but I think it is called, let me take a look, it's just called a pick, I guess. And I'm not sure what it's used for, but that's got a, um, an end, like a, I don't know, like a little plastic end to it so that you don't, you know, accidentally poke yourself. So it comes with that. And then it also comes with a stirring stick, a cotton swab, 
And then it also comes with a pipette. And then it did not come with, I think I got everything that it comes with here. It, I showed you these prepared slides and it does have blank slides so that you can make your own. Um, these ones right here. And like I said, I can't remember if these ones are the ones that came with it because I mixed everything together or if these are the ones that came with the set. But um, you'd have to take a look at the site if you're interested. But I bought these ones separately. They're 25 prepared biology microscope slides. And this is also from Amscope. And this is, it comes in a really nice wooden box, just like this. And I'll open it up and show you. And it's just got tons of prepared slides in it. And the girls will have a lot of fun taking a look at this stuff. Lots of different, let's see if I can easily show you some of these. Um, so right here is a, is a pine leaf. I don't know if you can, right there's a pine leaf. I, obviously I'm not gonna show them all cause you know, we'd be here all day, but I can show you maybe a couple of them. Um, let's see, a mushroom set. Oops, let's see if I can, I'm gonna get it enough so that you might be able to see some of it. Nope, I guess that's gonna be, nope, there's nothing that you can see on that one. You have, you need the microscope. <laughs> Weird that you would need a microscope for a microscope slide. But you know what I mean, you can see some of them. Like this one, it's a sunflower stem. And if I put it up against something that, yeah, see right there? you can see that there's something on the slide. And these are just, I can't remember what these are called, but these, it has the big circle in the middle, right here, going around the, going around. And that's because you, it keeps, if you have a concave kind of slide to it, um, if it goes down in the middle, it keeps it so that whatever is in there doesn't get crushed. And they do sell those separately on, um, Amazon so you can buy them for if you're if you kids if your kids are the type that want to look at maybe insects underneath or something you know something in a drop of water that you don't want to crush you can put it on a slide like that and then put the cover slide on top and you'll be able to see it without killing what's underneath um, and then I'll just maybe show you whoops I'll show you one more here um, onion oh you know what else you know what I'll do I'll show you the horsefly one the horsefly one, so gross and so fun, all at the same time. Um, they had a lot of fun with it. Pollen, pollen. These are blank slides. Oh, housefly. Yeah, look, <laughs> this is from the other set. And look, you can see the little bugger right there. It's so gross. And it's really hairy underneath the microscope. I wish I could show it to you, but I don't think that it would focus. I'm just going to set it right there, and I'll pick up after, but... Also, this comes with a microscope cover, which is great so that it doesn't um, get all dusty. It's a, it's a pretty thick cover, and it goes all the way over the microscope. So I wanted to show that it was included as well. And I also wanted to show you that I looked on the back and uh, of the, the Amscope box, and it's actually, um, it comes with, and I couldn't figure out which slide it came with, which set. And you can see on the slide, on the box right here, um, which one it comes with. It comes with these right here. I'll just give you another quick glance here at the microscope itself. And again, it's a really, it's a really nice microscope. It, it, I really like how clean it looks. Um, you know, some of the microscopes today look kind of old even when they're brand new they just look kind of old and this one's really sleek and I just I really like the design and I especially love the handle I really like that part I know that sounds kind of silly but I do I really like that part I love that we can put, put some batteries in there and just bring it outside and the girls can just run around the yard and find stuff that they want to look at under the microscope whether it be a bug or a plant part or you know it rained and they want to look at something underneath a pot in a you know in a puddle I think that would be fun so I'm hoping that we have a lot of fun with this set and I'll have to keep you posted as to the kinds of things that we take a look at. But again, here's just kind of a, a once over as far as what's, you know, what comes with it and then the stuff that I bought separate. And again, this does not come with, this set right here does not come with it. It is um, an, additional, an additional cost. I bought this separate. But the book, that comes with it and that's pretty awesome and that's one of the reasons I actually was 
when I was looking for microscopes, I was actually looking at this book to buy on top of a micro another microscope, and then I happened to see the reviews on this microscope and that the book came with it, so I was really excited I didn't have to buy that additional. So, lots of slides to go over, lots of blank slides for them to, to come up with their own stuff to take a peek at, and we should have fun with it. So I hope that if you are in the market for a microscope that this video has helped you uh, and give you, given you some information to ponder. If you like this video, please definitely give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't already, please subscribe to our channel. I would love to have you follow along. And I hope that you have a wonderful rest of your evening.